we're looking at the song Lay Down by DMAs and I'm going to break down all the different parts. I'm going to show you all the different solo sections, all the chord progressions uh, and also show you a simplified way to play it on the acoustic guitar as well. So let's dive right in. On my journey towards a thousand subscribers, I'm giving away two guitars, uh, an acoustic guitar, also an electric guitar. If you want to win one of those, make sure you watch this video right to the end. Right, let's look at the chords and how we play them on the electric guitar to kick off with. As we start the, the verse section, we're going to be doing an A, and we'll do an A5, which is your first finger on the thickest string at fret 5. And then I tend to use my little finger, you could use your ring finger, on the string below that at fret 7. Um, and I'm just going to be doing a fairly driving kind of... Um <laughs> I went through were fret 5 on the thickest string, fret 7, then to the strings below that, so strings 5 and 4 at fret 7 and then back to fret 5. So it's just going there, there, there and there. Let me show you how long I spend on each of those. So I'm going... <laughs> of strumming on the uh, fret 5 position going 1 and 2 and 3 and 4 and so did that four times there uh, then I did it um, once here once here and then two lots here and then it will start to loop around again the other main section is the chorus and for that we're going to be going down to fret 2 on the thickest string and going changes between fret 2 and fret 5 with that power chord shape. Now the only other section in the song is kind of a slightly altered chorus later on in the song um, where they're singing lay down, lay down, uh, give me someone new and then it says I know that it's drifting through her, her pain etc. Um, so for that section it kicks off with the normal chorus going between fret 2 and fret 5 um, but then it goes to a, um, a D5 which we're going to be doing, this is the shape we've got just here and we're getting this. Um. So you get one and two and three and four and and slide to fret seven. Two and three and four and up to the thickest pair of strings at uh, fret five and seven. And then another lot of strumming it on the fifth and fourth strings at fret five and seven. And then that loops around again. And that's all the different kind of main chord strumming sections that you can do on the electric guitar. Now let's take a look at the, the solo sections. So the intro section goes like this. for the hammer-ons and the pull-offs by that I mean where you play two notes by only picking once on the right hand uh, a bit later on in the song it's kind of an interlude section goes like this uh, So fairly, fairly simple section, um, just have a really good listen to it, and you're playing string 3 fret 14, and then the string below that 12, but you have to do it. So the solo kicks off with the uh, intro. Mm -hmm. Around again, and then it goes into this phrase, which 
quite tricky to get uh, at the speed and, and kind of keep it going. Um, but your first finger is going to be rooted on string 2 fret 10 and you're just doing a pull off from fret 12 and then playing the string above at fret 11. And you're just going to be looping that round and then when you get to the end of those form this shape. So your first finger stays where it is, middle finger goes where it's been playing and your third finger on the thinnest string. So you strum those three strings and then pick one, two, three. Then change shape to that. So you're going from that shape and then barring the thinnest two strings, keeping your middle finger where it is. And then the next section it goes on to uh, is where your little finger is going to be in fret 12. So you're going. Now you play that through again slowly, and uh, this might be a section you need to, to loop around. So let me show you these. back into the kind of main intro phrase. And then you're doing that looping, looping that round again and again and again. Uh, and then finally going back to these chords. And then you just end by strumming. That chord. If you want to play the song on the acoustic guitar, then I would put the capo on at fret two, um, and you'd be kicking off with a G chord, um, and you could just be doing something like this. Um. A minor, D, and C. So there's a G, A minor, D, C, and that would be the kind of verse. Let me show you that a few times. again and the rhythm I'm doing down 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 up down up so as it gets to the chorus you'd be going for an E minor G four times of that rhythm on each chord. The section is slightly later, later on with that sort of altered chorus. For that one, uh, I'd be going C, D, G, C, C, D, G, C. I hope you found that helpful, guys. If you have, please do subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Uh, and hit that like button. If you want to win one of those guitars I talked about, then yeah, make sure you're subscribed uh, and also leave a comment in the comment section of any one of my videos and then you're in with a chance of winning one of those guitars. Cheers guys.